Hey everybody, this is Chaz from DroidShark.com. I've got an application for you today called WoW Droid Armory. It is, for all you World of Warcraft players out there, it's basically a an Android interface with the online World of Warcraft Armory. Um, let's do look at your character, all your gear, your achievements, sort of thing. Um, it does a whole lot of stuff. So, yeah, let's take a look. Okay, so here is um, the WoW Droid Armory. Uh, the first screen you see, you just search for what you want. You can pick between all of the different servers. Um, you're probably going to have to bear with me. I don't have very good signal down here, so... Try and... Yeah, here we go. Way down here, there's so many servers. And where is it? Here it is. The Scryers. And my character name. And there he is, level 40, Gorf Hunter. Loads up all the info. And it shows you all of your current equipment. Um, you can tap on something and it will show you the stats for that item. Death chill armor. Your weapons. Um, you can even hit find an upgrade and it will search for things that are kind of relevant to the same item that you clicked on. So if this will load Alright, it shows all the other similar items that are within your level range. Precisely calibrated boomstick it is pretty awesome. <laughs> uh, Alright, you Let's see under stats your character stats and you can view your base stats, melee, range, spell, defense, all that good stuff. Got your talents, which again just give it a second to load. Alright, um I'm all survival spec so can view your entire talent tree, check out all the skills you have, click on them to get more information. You can view the other ones you don't have too. So and you also got your profession which just kind of shows you which professions you have in your levels. Progress, you can view your achievements, reputation, and your gear score. Um Team, you can view your arena and your guild. We'll look at that in a second. Um, info is not too important. In news and links. And the 3D view. This is a really cool feature that I'm actually pretty surprised they have on here. So I've loaded my character before, so hopefully it'll be a little faster. But you might have to give it a little time to load because I'm just on an edge connection. Alright, here we go. Here's my character. You load it up. Now you can see you can um, spin him around, look at things. You can zoom in. And it's pretty awesome. I mean, it displays very, very good representation of your character. You can display and hide your helmet or your weapons. 
Oh, I'll switch between showing my gun. That's cool. And um, there are a few quirks with it, like it's not the actual color my shoulder pads show up in game, and that's not my hairstyle. But I mean, in general, it works pretty well. And I'm not sure it might work a little better if you have a higher end device. This is just a G1, so uh, you can click this button up here and switch between different backgrounds. See now he's in Iron Forge. I believe it's Iron Forge, yeah. So yeah, um, that's a really cool feature. Uh, now back to team, you can view your guild and it will show you name of your guild, server you're on, and it will show your guild crest up there and it will list all the members. So, find someone, look at all their information. Now, um, you can also click the star up here to favorite people. So I'll favorite my friend and I'll favorite myself. And if you go back to the beginning, you can see down here, these are the favorited characters. You can also favorite your guild and then it'll show up down there too. And so that way you can just launch it and go right to your character or your friends without having to search for them every time, which is pretty handy and a very cool feature. Um, as far as options go, you've got, you can hide the notification bar, uh, choose a separate place to get the gear score, show your helmet, tap to run, and change the quality of the textures on the 3D model. So not a ton of, feet of uh, options, but you know, there's so many features in here, I don't need a ton of options anyways. Alright, so that was a look at um, WoW Droid Armory, that costs three euros on the market so I'm not sure exactly how that would um, correlate to US dollars but that's price on the market so um, there's also a free version too which has a um, a banner with ads on it which you can get if you don't feel like paying um, I would definitely recommend it if you play World of Warcraft it uh, you know it's, it's pretty handy you can show your character off to your friends if you're out you know talking about it, whatever. It's just a really fun thing to have. Um, so yeah, that's about it. I'm Chaz from droidshark.com. Remember to check out all of our other awesome videos, application reviews, and that sort of thing. And I will catch you guys later.